This, Matt, was difficult to achieve. I think it was like all night negotiations, but finally they have a package. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, 16 hours of negotiations is what it took in the end. Of course, they've been negotiating this from their offices for months now. But what they've decided, we're learning, is that Germany is going to set prices uh, for carbon dioxide emissions, uh, trading between energy uh, companies, um, building uh, construction companies, um, uh, airlines, etc. Uh, and that it, they'll be able to trade those around and it'll change prices um, for fuels in transport and heating. A DPA is reporting it'll boost those fuel prices three cents um, by, uh, uh, by next year and 10 cents by 2026. So we are expecting details to come out at a press conference. Uh, Merkel and the finance minister Olaf Scholz are going to speak in about an hour and a half. What you're looking at right now are pictures of the biggest uh, Fridays, uh, Friday protests that we've had so far. Every Friday, the kids around Germany take uh, the day off of school and protest um, to fight climate change. But today, it's spreading really around the world and is quite big around the Reichstag and the Brandenburg Gate.